Welcome back, everyone. We're at week 12 here. Knights, Rebels, Nick G. Welcome back to the studio, my friend. Thank you for having me back in person as we are both on summer break now. How I know. Doing? Yeah, sorry. My files, you know, had to take care of that. But now we're going to be back posting every weekend. It's going to be great, everyone. Hopefully, uh, you know, in a few couple months, we'll have season six for you. We'll get playoffs here in season five. Today. True. Absolutely. Big thing to talk about today. Hold on a second here, Nick G. Can we get the save off? And we get an own goal instead. Never mind. Poncho scores immediately. If you guys noticed out there, though, we got some different players out there. Maca Machine with the roster change. Nick G, please. Yeah, I'm... I'm happy that there was a change because the game, the, the Knights were on a four-game losing streak. There needed to be something. They needed a spark. Although, I wasn't expecting both players to get changed. As uh, Chris here will introduce them. Ooh. So, we got Tex, an old-time veteran, and Slider, another old-time veteran. I think that's why Maca Machine decided to switch it up. And I think he's just more comfortable playing with them right now. And given what's been happening recently, you know, I think he decided that that was the best route to go. And I guess hopefully we'll see that in today's game and hopefully get a win out of that. I don't know what you think, Nick. Yeah, I mean, their offense has been a complete knockout. Absolutely absent. I mean, I'm not sure the exact number, but at least I think they've had at least two games where they haven't had offense. Ball. Talk about defense, though, Nick G. Yeah, what that is was, that? I don't even know. You know, the defense the past couple games, I feel, has been solid, but. You know, I don't even know what's going on there. I mean, I guess Texas hasn't been playing that long. He forgot how to defend as he's turned around in the middle of the goal. Absolutely not. I mean, these opponents, though, are pretty good on the offensive side of the ball. You know, averaging probably two two goals a game. Is that right? Yeah, I'm here looking at the stats, and it seems that they are averaging about two goals a game, uh, along with four shots. So they get the ball on net. And, uh, they're very efficient with scoring. Yeah, hopefully uh, the Knights will be able to combat that in this you know, next three minutes and 30 seconds. Here's another shot, finally saved though by Mac and Machine. Does get the ball towards the side of the net here. Tex trying to reinforce, does not get it though. Mac and Machine with a clear here. Poncho there to put this back up. Now Tex Milk running away from the ball here. Mac and Machine does have an empty net here. Shot on goal, heading towards the net. He touches oh it! Oh my god, he missed, he missed it! He missed it! He missed it! And I just... He's missed it! It's just, I don't understand what he's been doing. That was crazy. Oh no, that's something you don't like to see from your captain. I mean, that right there is just another example. The offense not existing. And even when they do get chances, they just don't, they don't capitalize. I mean, Matt, even that was really bad if you're watching this. Hopefully you are, because you need some film days, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, look, I get the roster change, but I mean, I think I've voiced on the channel, I'm not 100% sure, but I've definitely told you, I was not a fan of Merlin. I feel like he played too much hero ball. So I wasn't surprised that he was changed, but he had a change, I just didn't expect. Yeah, I guess not. But here's an own goal here, and maybe, maybe we'll have a Knights win as a comeback win, no? Yeah, a spark definitely needed from Slider there. Great shot off the wall, makes Poncho put it in his own net. But, you know, that's something that I, the last time I was in the studio, that I said, they rely on the opponents making mistakes way too much. They need to play a more organized offense. They, the past couple weeks, they've been playing the 3-0 offense. Three attackers, no defense. You can't <laughs> win. Job on that. What a save by Mac and Machine. Wow, that really is going to keep them alive here for this next transition. Man, look at a uh, transition goal here for our techs. No one back in the back. Rebels here, Mac Machine with a chance, does get a touch, just get blocked through by Slider missing the ball here, does head towards the net. Tex gonna be able to get there though, gets a demo, what? Oh my god, and along with the save what there. What is happening right now? That was a messy sequence here, but Mac Machine does get a chance to redeem himself, puts it on the net, saved. Strongly by Outlaw, that's cleared away here. Now Poncho bring it to the corner, gonna try and get this around. No one misses, Mac Machine though. Learn from last game. You saw that, yeah. Nick G. Stops there. Doesn't hit in his own net. I'd love to see. I guess he has been watching film. Oh, this ball heading towards the goal. Can they get a clear? They do. Tex not able to get the rebound here. Now Schlatter coming in from behind. Coming back. Turning around. Gives the ball. 
Mac Machine in the middle, does line up the shot here, does not get a rip as Tex takes it from him. Now he's rolling up the wall. He's going to go into the middle here. Hopefully something can get on. Mac Machine, oh! Hits the post and just can't see And Slider does not have Oh, that ball is coming across. He was just not ready for it. No, no, he was not, but this ball going to be cleared out. Mac Machine does miss the ball now. Now they're on the counterattack. Does get a touch here, Poncho. Putting this towards the middle. It's going to be there. Tex, oh no, pops it up high. Clear. Does get the clear, thankfully. And now they're on the counterattack. Does get a strong, oh, Mac Machine bringing it to the corner here. Going to look for a center. Does do it. It's going to be slow. It's, it is there, but touched by Poncho. Tex just misses the, the net there. Tex with an opportunity of a lifetime. He just misses it wide. Yeah, I guess, you know, when Mac Machine put him in, I thought he would think that he's going to score more, and it just hasn't been doing that. Mac Machine with a bad touch in the middle here, and Poncho is going to take that free goal here. Yeah, I mean, the Knights have had their opportunities to tie up this game, and then eventually maybe go on a win. It just does not look like that. And, and you see here, Mac Machine enraged by that last play. He knows that that's just frustrating, and it's just looking like another Knights loss here. Yeah, they need to pick it up. They need to figure out something. It's just the past five weeks have not been something you want to see, and hopefully they can change that no. soon, go back to their winning ways. Absolutely. Now, the Knights going to move to 6-6 six and six here after starting the season 6-1, and one, continuing their losing streak. And now I think they're out of the top six to make the playoffs. Yeah, they bumped to eight there. Wow. That's not good. We, we hope that they can start picking it up, but... Something's going to need to change and fast. Absolutely. Well, Nick G, thanks for joining me in the studio as always. As always, it's a pleasure. All right, guys, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Peace. Peace.